The new world of electric vehicles and home charging inevitably means new brands entering the market and brands you might not have heard of, frankly, and that makes it pretty hard to choose a reliable product. One such new brand is Wave Charge, who has two products at the moment, the Wave EV1 and EV1i. We've been installing them for a few months now, so what's our verdict? Both the EV1 and the EV1i are pretty similar in style and shape. So we'll talk about the EV1i mostly in this video, but you can safely assume that a lot of what we say applies to the EV1 also. Both the EV1 and EV1i are tether chargers, so they come with a five meter cable attached and they're available in a matte black finish and they also have a handy cable storage solution around the edge. The main difference between the two is the EV1i has a more subtle design, so with a white font on the front versus the orange font on the EV1, and there's also this handy cable dock on the EV1i. Otherwise, there's not that much else to say about these two products. The design is pretty simple and inoffensive. Yeah, the build quality might not be up there with some more pricier products, but then again, these are some of the most affordable charge points on the market. You might be forgiven for thinking that with such a low price point, you end up with a pretty basic product, but you don't. We've been installing these chargers for a number of months now, and we've been highly impressed with the hardware and how reliable they are. On the app front, the Wave EV1 and EV1i make use of a third-party app called EV.Energy. Don't be alarmed though, as this is a bit of a masterstroke because designing and maintaining an app is by far from easy and a lot of other charger manufacturers have fallen short in this area. Using the EV.Energy app means you get a really high quality charging app and a lot of features that are normally associated with more expensive products. Again, highlighting what a great decision Wave Charge have made by partnering with this firm. It has a really neat interface and is fast and responsive. Plus, you can even connect it to compatible vehicles and it will tell you the status of your battery. Pretty neat. Head over to our written review where we discuss the EV.Energy app in a lot more detail. In short, it means you get a really reliable product with a high quality charging app at a lower cost than many other chargers. So should you buy a Wave Charge charge point? And if you are going to get one, which one should you get? Well, firstly, yeah, I have absolutely no hesitation in recommending this product. As I said earlier, we've been installing it for months now and we're very confident in the reliability. And in instances where there have been some problems, the Wave Charge team have been extremely quick and responsive to help out our customers. So definitely recommended. The only reason to get something else is if you wanted something a bit more compact or aesthetically pleasing, or of course, if you wanted an untethered charger where the charge point doesn't come with the cable attached and that gives you a bit more flexibility with the cable length and some people find that it looks a bit neater when the car isn't plugged in. So which one should you go for? Well, they're pretty much identical, but I think the EV1i is the one I personally opt for. The black and white finish is much neater than the black and orange, in my opinion. Plus, the cable storage is better as well, as you just get that dock on the EV1i, which you don't on the EV1. But there isn't that much in it. We hope you found this review of the EV1 and EV1i helpful. There is a lot more detail in our written review, so check that out in the link in the description below. Otherwise, we'll see you next time.